Today is another good day to try to get some stars or try to lose some stars. And I wonder which hero would be perfect to use to hurt the eyes of the people who main them. Come to think of it, I don't think I've played this cat's slave driver, so that's a pretty good win rate, right? So let's see if our teammates will switch us and they're not gonna regret their decision if their decision was to lose. And to increase our chances of not having a boring gold lane, let's switch to jungle. And now I kinda regret our decision because there's a Fanny in the enemy lane who's probably gonna kill me over and over. And now that we're in the game, we're just gonna start off by choosing the retribution that we like. And we're gonna go with bloody retribution because anything bloody is better. And it looks like Daddy Four Legs here is nice enough to help us with our jungling. That is very much appreciated. But I really don't think Ricky appreciates you whacking him with your big axe. And he helps me with the blue buff as well. Thank you so much. I think you should help our other teammates. Look at Themis in the minimap. I think he's getting double teamed by Nana and Balmond. Meanwhile, I've got to deal with this flying saucer murder machine because she's trying to get this bubble sore. I just know it. Now that the turtle is almost up, it looks like we'll have to start a team fight because if we kill one of them, it's gonna be easier for us to take our turtle suit. Unfortunately, instead of fighting us, the enemies backed off and are probably just hiding in that bush. So why don't we see if we can take this opportunity to secure our first ever turtle suit. Just a little bit more and we got it. And now we're back to killing the red. And this time we'll spare Ricky's life. You're welcome, Ricky. And now it's time to get the blue buff as well. This Hylos is very helpful, but I think he'll be more helpful if he roams around the map helping our other teammates. Meanwhile, I think I'm gonna ask Ricky for the money that he owes me. And how do we get that money? That's by killing him and letting him drop the gold. But he probably still might need that money, so we're gonna let him go for now because we can always take the money from this fanny. And as a responsible citizen, we gotta kill this Valir because he keeps starting forest fires and that's not good. So back to getting our buff. And we're also gonna wait for Lunox to come back, hopefully. And it looks like we're dealing some decent damage now because this blue buff is dying faster and faster. After that, it's time for round 2 of teaching this Valir that throwing fireballs at animals is not really the best thing you can do. But it looks like the fight may not be over because this Balmond and Fanny and everyone else on their team is after me. I guess they're just jealous I'm riding a big pussycat, which is Leo. But that is fine because all we gotta do is keep murdering these peace-loving creatures in the jungle. And if we find any peace-hating Balmonds around the area, then we're just gonna go ahead and kill them. And it looks like that raccoon is a witness to the crime that we just did, so let's get out of here. Turtle is almost up again and there's a flying saucer hiding in that bush. Also, we have Hanabi here who's trying to throw her BS at me. Why don't I penetrate your butt with my big arrows and it looks like she can't take the heat. Meanwhile, Fanny here is planning something and that plan is to go back to base by dying. And now that Fanny's dead, I think this is gonna be a free turtle soup for all of us. Good job team. Do you maybe need some help in taking down this living Beyblade? Well, actually, I don't think so because he's not spinning at all. It's probably broken. We should uh, get that returned to the manufacturer. And also, Hanabi, why do you keep abusing Natalia's with your ultimate? That's not very nice. Natalia lives matter too, you know? Hey, I think their blue buff is ripe to be stolen. And is Fanny here? I don't know. But I know that this Valir is here to save the day by giving his life so that Fanny can get her blue. Now if that isn't supporting your teammates, I don't know what is. How about we push bot lane this time? It's only gonna be against Hanabi and Balmond. And all we gotta do is avoid Hanabi's ult all over again. And this time she actually hit someone from my team. I guess she listened to me when I said that she shouldn't be abusing Natalia's with her ultimate. But she hit my teammate so I had to hit her really hard. And this Balmond seemed to be ignoring our existence so I had to end his existence. It's too bad that we couldn't catch that fanny but we should still be able to take down this tower and we can safely go back to base. 
now the Lord is almost up. It's a good thing that we already got both of our buffs and we can also get this gold that our teammate is working hard to get. And now we're acting like a real jungler, aren't we? But the Lord is up now and we gotta focus on dealing damage to this. Actually, our teammates are pretty busy here in the top lane. Maybe we can just join this team fight so we can keep teaching good manners to this Valir who likes burning stuff. And it looks like Thamus smelled something in that bush, and it was nothing. Because Hanabi's here, hiding under her tower. Also, Hylos is here, beating up the enemies. Unfortunately, they already backed out. How about we just steal their red buff and push the mid lane because we have minions here. But we also have Fanny here now, trying to murder Estes as hard as she can. I don't know what happened between them in the past, and I don't care. But what I care about is I'm being turned into a Molina while I'm being being roasted. It's not the best feeling at all. Let's get out of here. So it's time to get our jungle buff again and the lord is still up so let's get some more gold while waiting for our allies to get in position. And since everyone didn't get into position I think we're just gonna have to do this on our own. Or maybe we should just stop doing the lord and we should start doing the enemies. Because if everyone from the enemies has been done then they'll be satisfied and they'll be dead. Plus, they won't be stealing the Lord if they're dead, so let's go after them as much as we can and follow that Hanabi inside that bush where all her teammates are there waiting to kill me. But that is fine because all I gotta do is get all my buffs again so that we can start another war for the Lord. And this time, I think we should just go all in on this Lord. I'm pretty good with Retribution. I have 1% success in getting the Lord. See, I forgot to use my Retribution. Again, the enemies could have totally stolen that. But now that we have the Lord, all we gotta do is wait for it and get in position. In position to secure our kill. And the Lord is going towards bot lane so we can get all the towers here in the mid lane while they're defending. And we also get to secure some kills for our team. So it looks like three of the enemies are dead. I don't think raccoons are great for defending the base but this Balmond might pose a threat. So we'll just keep our distance while shooting down and clearing their minions. And this Balmond looks like he's escaping the prison that we have built for them which is their base. So he's gonna have to go down for that along with their tower. And now that the Lord is here, we're just gonna shoot this Fanny with our auto-aiming arrows. And maybe now we can strike a post right next to their base, which we are too late because that freaking Lord destroyed the base too early. But that's okay because sometimes you don't get the perfect victory selfie, you get a running version of it. So that is Irithyll and Leo, the big pussycat in the jungle. I'm pretty surprised that it worked out better than I expected but I enjoyed every minute of it. And I hope you're having a wonderful day and I hope you enjoyed the match as well. So again, my name is Shinmin Takazo. Thank you so much for watching these videos. Please check out the older videos for the different and many heroes we have played in the past. Hit like and subscribe if you enjoyed this one and as always, I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.